Hello there. What is going on, everybody? Today we have a starter for Drop Fleet Commander to look at, and this is the Post Human Republic starter, otherwise commonly referred to as PHR. Uh, this is an entire starter fleet for the PHR faction. They are their own faction. Drop Fleet Commander has uh, currently five different factions and uh, if you want to see more this is a great place if you're new here to the channel uh, there's still time left to enter to win the latest giveaway for the $25 Amazon gift card all you have to do is be a subscriber and leave a comment on this or one of my videos we have those running all of the time uh, this is a really cool looking fleet I, I love the look of these guys I can't wait to get them uh, put together now uh, this is gonna have three PHR cruisers four PHR frigates and a uh, fast play sheet. Let's go ahead and take a look at this particular box. And this was sent out by TT Combat. So big thanks to TT Combat for actually sending this out. Uh, as we, we've had a, quite a bit of uh, stuff to look at from uh, from TT Combat lately. So they sent us out, uh, you know, the two player starter and there's a couple other uh, faction starters too we're gonna be taking a look at. So there's definitely gonna be more. If you haven't uh, already seen some of my other stuff, I'll put some links at the end of the video. So you can take a look at everything that we're getting here. We've got ourselves some sprues, which are pretty nice looking sprues we've got um we've got our sticker sheets and i know some people were saying that uh that they weren't crazy about how the uh the bases were on a sprue but they do really look nice when they're all put together so i'll put some of these together uh we'll, we'll, we'll put them together and see kind of how they look towards the end of the video so you can uh, take a look at that we've got uh, a card here that has some helpful uh stuff as far as orders and basically some player aids crippling damage and catastrophic damage um and, uh, and we also have, uh, so, so our frigates, uh, it's basically a uh, little uh, ship uh, sheet, which has all of the, uh, basically, the information for the different uh, types of ships that we're going to have on here, too. Plus, everything is available online for these, as well as uh, some kind of, like, a recommended kind of starter um, uh, card options for your different, uh, your different battle groups. So that is pretty cool as well. All right, so uh, let's take a closer look at these sprues. All right, so first up we have the uh, the sprues for the PHR cruisers. There's going to be three of these. They're all going to be identical. Um, and uh, you've got basically the the, the, the main guts of, of the ship right here, the left and right sides. And you're going to have lots of additional pieces. Uh, and this is going to depend on how you build it. So uh, you're going to have different options uh, in here within the sprue itself. And uh, we'll take a look at some of the recommended builds and um, maybe we'll put some of these together. Um, but yeah, you're going to have three of these, and they're all going to be uh, identical. And so that's going to let you build your three different uh, cruisers. Um, and then, of course, right here we have the, uh, the frigates sprue, where you only have one sprue here. And these are going to be your smaller ships, uh, but you've got all four uh, corners of it, basically one set, two set, three set, four set, kind of like right here. And usually these, uh, in, in other starters, they've kind of given you enough to build like two of one type and two of another type. But there's going to be lots of different variety in there too so like you know you can kind of uh you can kind of mix and match uh and i build I, I think you know in some of the other ones i think there's like four uh four different types or sometimes even more than that in some cases so you can have a lot of different options so i have to do a little research and figure out which ones i'm going to build i'll probably follow the uh, recommended um builds here that are on the uh the little uh the quick uh quick play cards so uh yeah, very very cool here a lot of options I can't wait to see how they're going to look once they are put together. Let's uh, let's go ahead and put some of these together and uh, give you a little glimpse of how they look. All right, so I've got everything now put together. Uh, well, we're going to take a look at some of the uh, cruisers first. Um, I, I I really I really like these. I went with all of the recommended um, versions. Uh, I kind of followed the uh, cards in the basic uh, A, B, and C uh, battle group cards. And so I let that kind of guide me. So I did what, uh, like a, uh, this one, was, oh, this one is, I think the, the Hector. Yeah, this is the Hector cruiser. Very cool. We got some great, uh, great options for painting in here. Um, my only criticism with this is that like this, the frames kind of connected right here on the top of like the curved part. So that made it a little bit, uh, a lot, I had to do a lot of shaving in there. Um, then we've got, uh, I, I built three different variants of the cruisers here. Um, but like, I think they're going to look fine once they get some paint on them. But uh, it was a little bit of a, a little bit of shaving right on the curved parts. You can see a little bit of it right there. Um, this one's kind of half carrier, half to, oh, and of course I did not glue it into here yet because we're going to, of course, do our 
uh, our priming and our base coating on there first before I do any gluing of the, uh, the base pieces. And then we've got uh, this little dude right there. Oh yeah, I put his wings kind of down. So the cool thing is here to when the wings or the winged pieces go in, you can kind of angle them up a little bit higher or a little bit lower. And I decided to give this one a slightly different look. Um, oh yeah, and he's also not glued into that part yet. So he's just kind of resting there right now. Um, so that's the cruisers. We've also got a couple of uh, the frigates. Um, come on, go in here in the base, and, and the bases, uh, the bases go together just, just great. You, you got, you got these little pegs that can track the numbers on there, and you can track their status with colors and shift those around as well too. So I've got two of the, um, uh, I believe the Medea Strike Carriers, which are these kind right here, um, and these had also a frame connection, like kind of in the front or kind of on the nose. But uh, but that one was not as as bad to kind of sand out, and so I built two of these. Although there's different options too, right? Like I, I did this whole printout. They have this on, online, so you can build Europas, Pandoras, Calypsos, Andromedas, or Medeas. But I went with two of the Medeas and two of the Europas, and I kind of like I kind of like the Europas too because you have this big old gun arm at the bottom that you can kind of uh, you can kind of position however you want. So I had this one kind of going real far in the back, and I had the other the second one kind of going a little bit farther down below so you have a little bit of flexibility on how you uh, build them uh, even within the same specific uh, class so uh, so that much is pretty cool and uh, yeah I like them all right so that is the PHR the post human Republic starter fleet again big thanks to TC combat for sending uh, this out for review we have a lot more drop fleet videos so be sure to check them out and with more on the way. Uh, if you want to see these guys painted, be sure to check out other links in the description below. Uh, we're uh, also posting more Drop Fleet Commander discussion uh, in, in, the, uh, in the Discord. We, uh, if you want to follow me on social media, you'll find some photos, uh, Instagram, Twitter, and all that stuff. Uh, I've been doing some uh, fleet painting and uh, been kind of having some fun with it on there. So if you want to learn more, uh, check out the links in the description below. Uh, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And big thanks to my patrons. You guys are absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, have a great day.